So if you don't know yet, YouTube is finally releasing YouTube Shorts, and you can actually get started getting paid that mornays from your short creations. So in this video, I'm going to show you exactly three from the easiest to the most difficult to the most laziest ways of how you create a simple YouTube short. So the first easiest way and the laziest way of how I create a YouTube short is simply by using the YouTube app. All you want to do is sign into your account, pick your own video that you just create a long form content out of, and there's a little remix button. You hit that remix button and then you can create a YouTube short within YouTube itself. So you don't have to worry about any editing, all this. You can just take any old of your videos and create a YouTube short from that video. You select the duration of it, and then all you do is click upload, and hey, you just made your own YouTube short out of your own YouTube videos. The second lazy way of making a YouTube short is you repurpose all of your short form content. This means using all your TikToks, your Instagram Reels, your Facebook Reels, all those micro content that you have already created, all you need to do is you can take that and use something like a third party website, you know, depending on which ones, just be careful, always read the fine print. There's things like SnapTik, as well as other third party websites that actually remove that watermark, whether that's a TikTok logo or Instagram Reel logo, and you have that raw video and all you need to do is just upload that straight onto YouTube. And yes, I already have two videos on this, so you, if you want to know exactly how you remove that watermark, link in the description below to check those videos out. And the last and most convenient way of how you edit a YouTube short is going within Premiere Pro or any sort of your video editing platforms. If you haven't figured it out yet, YouTube shorts exactly the same way that you would edit a TikTok or Instagram Reel. So all you need to do is open up Premiere Pro, making sure your dimensions, this is the most important part, making sure your dimensions and export settings are 1080 by 1920, meaning that it is in vertical format. If you upload a video that's in like black bars on the side and you upload that, YouTube is not gonna detect that as being a short. You need to make sure the video export settings are 1080 by 1920, AKA nine by 16 ratio. The minute that you have that video, you talk about it, you have a talking head, do whatever you want, have captions, link in the description below if you wanna figure out how you do captions, all that is in the description below. So what you wanna do is after you export that video, you'll upload onto YouTube, you need to make sure that one, it is shorter than 60 seconds. If it's a minute and three seconds, YouTube is not gonna detect that as a short yet, and it's just gonna have a normal YouTube video with the black bars on the side. You do not want that. Making sure that it's vertical format as well as making sure it's nine by 16. And no, you do not need to put hashtag shorts, hashtag whatever, because I've seen a lot of people do that in the beginning. People are kind of following a trend. But now all you need to do is just upload the video. YouTube will detect if it meets those parameters and it should be on your channel as a YouTube short. And how you know it's a YouTube short is that it has that little YouTube short icon in the bottom corner. So guys, now you know how to create a YouTube short, the easy, the lazy, and the fast, and the hard, more pro way of how I would create a YouTube short. If you guys wanna learn more about short form content and how you create the most bang for your buck when it comes to all this content, especially if you're just doing this yourself, I have an entire playlist of how you create any type of short form content. My name is Peter, help me help you, and we all start with nothing, but you can always create something. Cheers guys.